I hope you are as well because it's time now to go on TikTok. Now, TikTok has unearthed so many talented young people all across the globe, and Ghana is not an exception. Now, if you combine their likes and even their following, we're looking at hundreds of millions of likes. And of course, one has 5 million followers, the other has about 1.4 million, one has about 4.3 million followers, and they're doing bingy tins on TikTok and making loads of shmoney. Are you ready to find out who they are? Yeah. Well, are you guys on TikTok, by the way? Yeah. Who do you follow? Who do you follow? Oh. All of them. Oh. Yeah. So, do you know Wesley Kessy, the King of Kings? Yeah. Well, let's welcome Wesley! Yeah. Hey, Woo. Wesley, I know you dance, so, so do something. Do something. Welcome to the day show. Yeah. Have a seat, guys, have a seat. How y'all doing? We're good. Chief. You're good? Wait, five million likes of what? Followers? Followers. Five million followers and what? Over 90 something million likes. Nine to three million likes. Hey! 4.3 million followers yes. and 60 something thousand likes. Then you have 1.4. Yeah. And how many likes do you have? Like 27. Charlie, you guys are not playing. Do you know how much money you're sitting on? <laughs> Imagine you had to convert your likes and your followers into money. If even every person is one CD. Do you know how rich you guys are? Yes, very rich. That's a big deal. How did you discover TikTok and why did you go on there? I start with King of Kings. Oh Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> so um, it happened. That I think in 2016, it was called Musically, and then by then, nobody was there. I didn't see any black person there, so I no? just do no. I just do videos and then I post it on my social, like my Snapchat, yeah. and Instagram. Okay. And then in 2020, no. When, when was the, um, the pandemic? 2020, yes. 2020, yeah. yes. I went back to the, um, the app, and then I saw people making videos. It was so funny. So I just wanted to join. I said, you know what? Let me just be a part of this. I'm just going to do it for the fun of it, because everybody was home. Yeah. And then I never knew it was going to turn into something this huge. And you focus a lot on what? Fashion? So uh, I'm jack of all trades. Oh, everything? Yeah, I could do a little bit of dancing, acting, fashion, eating, everything. I eating mean, as well? What's yeah. your favorite food? Uh, Blanco and Oko. Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> hey, Kia. What you do? You are everywhere. Oh, I see. I hear you cook as well. Yes. I see. Uh -huh. Charlie, how are you doing? I'm fine. How are you? Social media. I'm good. Thank you very much. Social media has really, really done a lot for you, hasn't yeah, it? It has. Tell me about the positives because a lot of people talk about social media and they're like, eh, it's not a good place because people are always showcasing their talent, their riches and blah, blah, blah. But for you, it was more about talent and making some money off it. Of course, it was because, um, you know, I didn't come from a background where we are rich. Mm -hmm. It's somehow, somehow. So um, TikTok has really, really helped me, like, in my career and everything. Like, now it has helped me in everything. And I can even, like, purchase some things for myself that I couldn't before. Like what? Oh, first, I can't even buy wig. Me, how you couldn't buy your own wig? No. Okay. I couldn't even, how many shoes did I used to have that time? Like two. <laughs> <laughs> you had only two shoes. I'm telling you. Before and TikTok? Yeah, like I'm trying to let you know, like, yeah. like I didn't have like a lot, like a lot like that. And you know, um, there are some things that now I can do for myself that I, didn't even have, I don't even have to ask my brothers or my mom or something. So yeah. How did you convert it into money? That's the thing. Because I mean, everybody's on Twitter, everybody's on Instagram. Are you making money? Yeah, so how come TikTok, the people are making so much money? What is it about TikTok? Okay, so um, this is how we make our money. By when people come to us, like brands, and they want us to advertise something, no, I charge you. Okay. And then, yes, I make a video for you, song promotions. And then TikTok, we also make money through live stream. I can go live, and then my fans can just be gifting me. Oh, so when they gift you, you make money? Yes, yeah. dollars. Yeah. What? In dollars, yeah. <laughs> That's dollars. how much money you guys make? Yes. Do you know I have the app, but I don't even know what to do with it. <laughs> you guys are making dollars? Yeah. Hey, yeah. what's up? Oh my God. <laughs> How far now? I'm good. Everything okay? Sure. So, so you decided to bring comedy on TikTok some way, somehow, and it worked for you. How did you discover TikTok? Okay, actually, I finished secondary school. I was 2017, and I started working in the microfinance bank. Um, after the mic, what Jesus Christ is gay? Because you both do the same thing. Right? Somebody, don't forget. <laughs> oh, what has she done to you? <laughs> no, 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 no. You know. Uh... <laughs> yeah. okay. What's going on? Uh -huh. Everything no, okay? She's, you need a glass she's of not water, believing me. No, she's not believing me. Hey, you told me that you used to tell me what. He told me he used to tell me what. Yes. No, the thing is, <laughs> let, let me explain. Let me explain. Okay. Good. 
Before TikTok, the last work I I, I wasn't selling pure water, but like we produce. Okay. Yeah, I sit with the machine where we produce pure water. Okay. That was before TikTok. Was that here or say, in Nigeria? In Ghana here. Okay. But I'm trying to say when I finished secondary school, I went to do a job in microfinance, and whilst I was working. You see this betting stuff, mm. boys and stuff. Mm. I used some money to bet. And I'm not going to talk Like, I used some money it to bet. It was Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Carry on. Okay. I used some money to bet, and it was like, actually, yeah. So it was about 4,000 to this then. Mm. So they were like, I have to stop the work, go look for a different work, and pay back. Mm -hmm. you get. So that was when I went to start the pure water job. Oh. Yes, to use and pay back. Okay. And even that, I don't know, was I even able to pay? I think I even used almost one year to pay like thousand cities. I'm you are kidding. You. One yeah. whole year. But when I started TikTok, it wasn't up to three months I sent their money to What them. was the biggest <laughs> amount you made in three months? In at the pure water? No. On TikTok, because you're saying that in three months you were making so much money. What was the highest amount you had made by three months on TikTok? Oh, actually it depends on because at at the time. I wasn't this um, famous. Mm. All I do was to go live stream with your cover and sleep. talk with yeah, talk with my fans. They love what I do. They send me gifts and stuff. It depends. A day you could make like five thousand Ghana cedis. A day. A day. Yeah. I'm not joking. A day. A day. Yeah. More than more, more than, than five thousand a day. More than that yeah. a day. Like how much? Like ten thousand. A day. Yeah. 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 So in a week, if you're on like seven days in a week, that's seventy thousand. Yeah, yeah. If if you have the strength, if you're lesbian, you and one thing with live stream, you need to get time for it. Yeah. If you're working, you're doing other things, you won't get. You can. You need to stay for like three hours. Yes. Three long hours okay. going so live. What happened was we were running shifts mm -hmm. at our workplace because the it was raining season and the pure thousand going. So they said, okay, this week everybody will shift in it. You go home this week. So it was my turn to go home. Mm -hmm. I went home. That's when I downloaded TikTok. And in that one week, I made 2,000 cities mm -hmm. in a week because I was just starting. Even made, your first week? Yeah, and they paid me 500 cities in a month. Hey. So just that week, staying on 2,000 cities, <laughs> I talked to some of my friends. My brother, hey, I'll stop this work and sit in the house. <laughs> <laughs> so that was how I actually started TikTok. I'll come to you guys, but when did the carbon slit thing start? Was it the first week or it took you a while okay. to... Okay, the, 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 the carbon slit actually came... I like, did you hear what you said? The carbon, carbon, carbon slit. slit. Yeah. Carbon slit. You don't carbon play. Slit. Carry on. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> when did it start? Okay, it started February. Yes, I've been on TikTok for almost two years. Mm -hmm. But my fame started this February. And it all started from her advice. Oh, she gave you the advice? Yes. Because all I was doing on TikTok was just going live with my fans, like cashing out. That was all I was doing. Okay. Yeah, but nobody knew me. Mm -hmm. Digga is just one or two people, Digga. So she was like, add comedy. She said add comedy. Yes, to your live stream. But she was doing comedy already by yes, then. Yes, yes. So and that it was, was why working she advised for her. me, yes. Have you always been a comedian or you discovered that talent on TikTok? I've always been, but I do that to my friends. Okay. Like just the people around me, but not like into a video form to let the whole world see, no. It happened all of a sudden. Yeah. On TikTok. It's like all of a sudden, queer was everywhere and everybody was talking about you watching your videos and your numbers were just going high. What were you doing? I was so bored. I was so bored at home because that time that was during the COVID and um, our school, University of Ghana, yeah. they made a policy where level 100 and 400 had to go to school and 200 and 300 had to stay home and I was in 200. So okay. obviously, I was just in the same routine every day, bath, sleep, watch a movie, eat, bath, sleep. <laughs> what? I can't, I can't do that. You so, can't keep up with sleeping no, and no, eating no, and watching no, movies. No, 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 And like you seeing your friends out there doing something for yourself and it's like you, you, it's like you, you don't have anything, you can't yeah. do anything. If you, ah, and you see your friends dressing nice, they be wearing one cover and sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, okay. First, I started with, like, I was just having fun on the app. Like, I was actually having fun because seeing people like Wesley, Jacqueline, like, they were doing a lot. So Wesley was, like, was there already? Yes. Wesley ah. was acting, like, serious. And Jacqueline was doing the facial expressions and all that. Mm -hmm. I was like, ah, let me just start doing it. Let me just do something to just keep up with myself because I was so bored. Mm -hmm. And then I started it. And then one fateful afternoon, I saw a video of somebody. And I was like, I was going to recreate. Okay. But in my own way. Mm -hmm. And when I did it, I was even surprised. And people mm -hmm. were now tagging me that I should continue. And I did the next one again. I posted it in the evening. Mm -hmm. But it wasn't pushing. So oh. something was like, okay, I delete it, delete it. Something was like, no, no, keep it. Even if it doesn't go, you can still create again. And when I woke up, the video blew. 
yeah, me and I everybody was in the comment section. Like, what video was, like, was that? What did you do in that video? It was a South African song. Mm -hmm. And it was just a beat. And I was using um, that that they used to chew Bangunu. Bangunu. Uh -huh. I used to beat <laughs> like my child, yes. Yeah, and you were just and, singing. Yes. And it just went viral. It just went viral, just like that. Yemi yeah, Alade was in your DM. I mean, she was in the comment section. For her to say it's nice, that means I did a great job. Wow! <laughs> That's a big deal. <laughs> and by the time these kids on the block join TikTok, you were there already cashing out. Because it's, it's not easy. It's one thing jumping on social media and another thing finding out that it is a very lucrative business. Right. You dress into women and all that. So that's what I was asking about the fashion part because I know that that part also kicks in. Yeah. How did you discover that part of you? Uh, the, the woman part? Yes. All right, so um, I used to do that on my Snapchat a lot. Mm. So before TikTok and Instagram, I mean, when you go to my Instagram, you see a different person. Because when you go to my Instagram, you're going to see a fine boy looking nice, yeah. looking dapper. But when you come to my Snapchat, that is why I do all the foolery. Like, that's why I make people laugh. Because mm. I used to make my friends laugh. Okay. And then Snapchat came. And I said, oh, why not? If Snapchat is here, let me just use that opportunity. So I actually had a lot of audience on Snapchat. Mm. And I started wearing the wigs, and then that was it. And I'm sure every time they're looking forward to your next video, how do you come up with your ideas? Uh, I mean, I take inspiration from anything. I mean, people around, the environment. It depends on what I see. I mean, I could see this tree and think, oh, it's April, Palm Sunday. Can I do something with this thing? Oh, OK, no, well, let me just stand in and do something, and that's, that's it. I see, just yeah. like that. Yeah. yeah. But the thing is, you know, a lot of people feel, and musicians were complaining about TikTok and the fact that instead of it to promote your music, it actually kills your music faster. You didn't hear that? Kills your music? Yes, because it makes it popular one minute, everybody's vibing to it, then there's another song, and all of a sudden everybody moves from that challenge to another one. So they had a problem with that, and they weren't sure if TikTok was the place to go when you have a new song. But the, the seasons and times, I mean, if your song blows, it can blow like the whole year. Mm. It'll blow for a period of time. Bring another one. If it's a banger, it will go. And if it's not, it won't fly. Mm -mm. But you guys make it a banger. Yes. Yeah. You believe in that part as well. But yes. people think that TikTok is getting out of hand. No. It's not? I mean, not? It's, it's just coming from somebody who's hating. Exactly. Someone who's hating? Yeah. yeah. How? Trust me, I mean, Bella, uh, we've been there for like, what, two years. We've promoted so many songs. I mean, we're even bringing back the old songs. Like, they're just playing and then we're creating content for them. Mm. So, I mean, if we create content with it and then every influencer, just imagine, all the big influencers are hopping onto it. Mm. Don't you think it's going to go viral? Yeah. Yeah, so sometimes, even if, it's, if the song is bad, we can still make it go viral. What about the nudity and the fights? It's like every minute someone is fighting someone on TikTok. Uh, and that, that seems to have become the fashion on there now. And people think that, you know, TikTok is losing its essence because of these things. I've seen a couple of these fights, and I'm thinking, why are these people even doing that to themselves? Yeah, they don't have content. They don't have content? So some, you you know, think that's why? Yeah. yeah. People are just, some of them are chasing clouds. Exactly. They just want to fight with people, so yes. people get to know them. Yeah. But there's nudity. There's a nudity aspect as well. But not, not, in, not in Africa. Not in you, Africa? Yeah. I mean, when you're even driving and you, you post it on your TikTok, they can ban it. Yeah, they ban you. Oh, in Ghana. Yeah, you can't even if take off your shirt. It's a different social platform, fine. But TikTok. You can't you can even can take off your shirt. They jump like they do right there. Yes. Part Something violence. Yeah. TikTok oh, so you always have sensitive. to be careful. But yeah. we're yeah. seeing a lot of that, especially on the international platforms as well. So I'm just thinking that do you sometimes feel a bit of pressure to want to toe that line because maybe those are what are getting the numbers? No. Never, ever. Never. You never feel that never. way? Never. What are some of the challenges being on TikTok, creating content? Uh. <laughs> well, I'm sure this one you know. <laughs> I don't know. Tell me. No, because it happens everywhere. Um, the hate comments. You know, people could just hate you for no reason. They just hate you for you being yourself. Doesn't they could just, you know, they want to do anything just to bring you down. Yeah. And, I mean, I feel like it's part of the job. I mean, that's what we signed up for. So, while you're doing you, we're also going to do... Um, I feel like when they say that, you even do it more. Yeah. When they yeah. say you rather do it more. You motivate yeah, you, us. I mean, for example, people come on my page and be like, oh, this girl's not even funny. But what oh, I've done... You get people say that yeah, about you. Yeah. They be like, this us. girl's not even funny. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop what you're doing. But this thing I've been doing, is, is that, that's the thing that has <laughs> got me to where I am. And even here, I'm even on a day show today. Mm -hmm. So what are you telling yeah. me? Oh, that was a fun. Was <laughs> so you're not stopping anytime soon? No. But what other challenges have you faced personally um, on TikTok? Oh. 
Um, on TikTok, I would say it's more of the hate, the hate and the mm. negative comment and not maybe not TikTok per se, but people come into your DM and Instagram. For example, if they want you to do like an ad for them and then you tell them that, oh, this is how much I'm going to charge. And they'll be like, ah, for what? This video. This small video you're doing. If I use my phone to shoot it. And I was like, okay. Use your phone. Use, use your phone. phone and shoot oh, it. Oh, no. But usually how much would you charge? Um, Bella, you have to come to my DM so we discuss because I need to put some things in check. Don't give contract. me an exact figure, but give me a range. Let's like say I range. have a product, I want you to promote it. It's just in the thousands, that's what I tell you, for her. In the thousands? Well, it's, it's not thousands, like no. in the thousands. In the ten thousands. Hey, it's wait, still what? Thousands. what? In ten thousands? thousands. In the uh, thousands? No, in thousands. In the actually. forty thousands. I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> and then people are charging a lot. <coughs> I pay in tax. It? Now they've been deducting it. Oh, they've been deducting yes, it. Yes, yes, oh, they deduct them, now. Yeah. yeah. I see. Yes. Just so GRA doesn't come after you. I was so oh. upset recently because. You're upset about it? Yes. Why? No, it was a lot. What it took was a lot. But it is tax. Uh, but I mean, most of my years. Musha, we are creating content, <laughs> so it's fine anyway. He, it pained me, but it's okay. Where are you taking all this to? I mean, for you as a brand that you're building, what do you want to see eventually if today TikTok goes down? Okay. Where do you want to find yourself? The thing is, exactly the advice she gave me, she was like, you're going live, you're cashing out. Mm -hmm. But you need fame as well. Okay. So creating content to get you the fame. Mm. If TikTok crashes right now, uh, honestly, it's just meeting one or two people already. Mm. Mm. Because there are connections that have already been built down. Like, you know, when you, you say there was a time um, someone was telling me, the way you are giving your all to this TikTok, you stopped your work, then, 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 then. What if TikTok breaks down? You see, there was a day WhatsApp and um, this app. WhatsApp and um, Instagram. Yeah. yeah. It went down. It went down. I remember, yes. So someone was like, okay, so what if TikTok goes I said, down? yes, that is why I'm killing myself for it. So that eventually, even if it crashes, I know I've gotten enough and even more than enough that I want okay. from it. But if I take it steady and slowly and it crashes, I'll be like, oh, if I had known, I would have Fast done digital, more. Yeah. G -get. But you don't want to stay on TikTok your whole life. You Eventually, you want to graduate to something else. Definitely. Is it movies? Is it Definitely into movies. Stand-up comedy? Movies and music. And music? <laughs> Is it? <laughs> Is he kidding me or he's actually serious? Maybe he's no, serious. No, gospel with... music. Oh, gospel? Geez. Yes, I bet. <laughs> gospel. <laughs> What's your favorite gospel song? My favorite gospel song, uh, um, wait. Hey, <laughs> Let me see. Um, precious. You don't know? No, not Precious. No, I'm just trying to look for a song, a very okay. good song. You'll have to sing it too, so be careful which one you select. Hmm. No, you don't, you don't remember again. I'm even surprised. <laughs> I, can, I can sing any song. Okay, actually. go ahead. <laughs> okay. Light of the world. You step down into darkness. Woo! A rope. Hey, 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 hey Jesus. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> but you started well. What are you, shy of? Somebody screamed at the back. Oh, that's loud. Because they're loving what you're doing. I'm a shy person. Oh, do it twice. Well. I beg. I'm a shy person. Yeah, shy? Yeah, honestly. You? Shy? I'm a shy with all that you do? Yeah, I'm very shy too. I'm a very yeah, shy right, person. Right, guys. Stop kidding. Because me. if you watch most of my videos, it's in front of me, it's in my compound. Uh huh. Yes. But most of my friends are the streets where people are what? Mm -hmm. You don't no, like the oh, that's me. No, 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 no. Uh, yeah, okay, okay. I know what to do. If we uh -huh. are in Mona Lisa, uh -huh. Mona. under traffic light. No, under traffic light. That one, now you're dozing. Awesome. You have me. You so that one you could do it. Fine. But, but if it was Jesse, you wouldn't mm, have done I it. I won't even try. I'll just in my house. You too? Yeah. And sometimes eh, not, when I'm in my entirely. compound, uh -huh. because my compound is not fast. Okay. When I'm in my compound and I hear like a motorbike, I'll just run inside and stop first. I'm telling you. How? I don't know. I'm a very shy person, honestly. That's what he claims. Right. Yeah. You are not shy. Not entirely shy. Exactly. But I'm I'm shy sometimes. It sometimes. Depends. How do I you mean, deal if with I, the crowd? I mean, if I have to... So today, for instance, I have to be here. Mm -hmm. It's my work. It's a must. Mm -hmm. So then I have to, you know, show up and do what I have to do. But on a regular day, if you just call me out of the blue and say, Oh, Wesley, I want you... Oh, no, 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 
I can't. Like, I'm shy. My voice. I keep saying my voice, but mm. I'm, I'm so, you know, audible. But I, I always say that. Oh, I have a problem with my voice. It. I can't do it. But there's something that you do very well. I don't even know why we're not seeing it anymore. Your jollof business. How did you know I cooked? The, <laughs> you know, I actually cook the best jollof. I'll, you I'll, do? Yeah. Why don't you bring us some? Don't worry, I'll surprise you. Okay. <laughs> yes. So, what, did you have like a restaurant or something? Yeah, I used to. I wasn't doing much. And then I decided to, you know, start the food business. Mm. It was going well. And mm. then, you know, TikTok just said, hello, honey, I'm here. So can we just, you know, put that on hold and I get know. to... And you did, you put that on hold? Yes. So it's never coming back? No, it's coming back. When? Very soon. Okay. And you're going to guarantee us that when you make that jollof, we're all getting the... Oh, yes. Deal? It's a promise. It's a deal. Okay. Yes. We're looking forward to it. Now, the whole time you're talking, I'm sure people have said it before, you have sort of like a very slight Nigerian accent. Yes. Have you stayed there before, or is it from going to work there sometimes? Hmm. Or the people that you were with? Because he also has that accent, but he's Ifiani, <coughs> so. <laughs> okay, so um, I've stayed there for like years because oh. um, my mom and my dad, they met themselves there, love story, blah, blah, blah. So were you born there? No. Okay. I was born in Ghana, mm -hmm. but like because of my parents, I had to stay there, go to school there, but I used to come to Ghana. Till, till, like, I told my mommy that I didn't want to stay in Nigeria anymore. Like, I didn't, I don't, don't know why. Like, I just wanted to stay in Ghana. And oh. I just like the educational system and everything. And really, the place is so calm. So I was like, no, I'm going to stay here. And I'm very happy that I did. And I stayed You're there. happy you made that decision to yes. stay in Ghana. Yes. Why? Because, um, I don't know. Probably, um, I wouldn't have been where I am today because maybe I think and all, the, all these decisions we take take us to another path. So maybe if I didn't decide, I don't think maybe I'll be doing TikTok. Maybe another thing. Something else. Know, yes. Exactly. And maybe I wouldn't have been bored. Or, mm -hmm. Yeah, so. And but you've been back to Nigeria. You've done a couple of things with some of the big names. Yes. Like who and who? Tell us who and who you met. Okay, so I did something with Zlatan. Wow. Um, I did something with... Yeah, a lot too. Yeah. A lot yeah. of them. MC Lively. MC Lively. Yeah. Sabinos. Um, uh, what of Mr. Evil? No, he did something with Mr. Yeah, Shea Vibes. I did something with him. And all this was just from TikTok? Yes, from yeah. TikTok. So you guys connect on there and then you yes. fly, go do your work yes. and come back. Yes. That's a big deal. Where do you want to see yourself? Maybe the next five, ten years? I, I don't want to be... I know TikTok is the app that have brought me where I am today, but I don't want to be put in that category like TikTok, TikTok. No, I want to be out there. I want people to know me. Like, I wanted to add something to what he said. For example, like, even if TikTok is not there, I'm always trying to put a plan B. For example, I'm going to school, I'm in the University of Ghana. Okay. And we, these are all apps. If it crashes, you, that's why you need to be building all your platforms. So what if TikTok is not there? I'm on Instagram. I'm yeah. known. I'm on Facebook. Mm. Or what if all the apps are not there? I should, I, like, people should know me, even without the app. Like, they should be able to tell, this is a queer official, just like how we know Kweku Menu, yeah. Lewin, even if there's no social media. So that is how I want to see myself out so there. So do you want to become an actor, stand-up comedian? Everything. Everything? After, go to school, TikTok. You like too much money. You like too much money. And you, of course, an actor, I believe. An actor. Have you started? Yes, I have. You I've have. shot a couple of um, <laughs> movies, even way before TikTok. Does it pay? Uh, not entirely, but we're hoping that we get international recognition and then... Amen you know. to that. Hollywood, we're coming, right? Yes. We'll be right back to play a game as well. Don't go anywhere. Keep watching.